like, wow, Navi, I'm doing some really great progress. I'm excited. I'm actually going to beat this game faster than I thought. Listen. What, Navi? I'm okay. I mean, if you say so, let's talk to her then. Listen. Hello again, Etro. How you been? Zay. Today, I'm going to tell you a very important story. A story revolving the world of Rhinecrag. As I said before, because you are the chosen one, only you can defeat this game. However, by this point you might be confused as to how to defeat the game. Yes, I actually am, Metro. I've been talking to Navi and she's like, Go to the next area, go to this area, blah blah bullshit this, bullshit that. And I'm like, can you just tell me, like, what I actually have to do? And then she's like, Listen, with her little shit, you know? Hey! No offense, Navi. I love you, Navi. I do. Okay, well, first of all, I should tell you the story about the ruler of this world. The ruler of this world is known as Extet, a very powerful being who can destroy enemies in seconds. Although Extet is powerful, he also has his minions with him. There are five guardians in the world of Rhinecraft and every single one is guarding a jewel. All five of these jewels are needed in order to get to his throne. However, each jewel also possesses the power to summon a unique being into battle. So basically, there are five powerful summons in this game. I don't actually know what these summons are, however, I have heard that they are very powerful. So, who did you hear that from? Because you are the goddess, I would assume you know everything, like who did you talk to? Well, actually, funny story. But I was captured by Xdeath not too long ago. I did, however, manage to escape a little bit before Navi found you. Because I am the goddess, Xdeath knows that I know a lot about this world and I can help the Chosen One and other players as well with my knowledge. This is exactly why Xdeath chose to capture me. So that way, I don't help anyone out and that way he rules the world forever. But because I escaped, I managed to give you all this information, and you also have Navi along as well, so you're in pretty good hands. However, back to the five guardians. So as I said, they each guard a jewel, but each guardian is very powerful on their own. They're essentially five of the toughest bosses in the entire game. I do know their names, but I don't know the strategies to defeat them easily. The five guardians of Rhinecrag are known as Goliath, Astaroth, Valerie, Cortez, and Zargaboth. So these five guardians each guard a powerful jewel that can help you summon a beam. But, again, you need all five of these jewels to actually reach x in the end. So in other words, your main goal of this game is to destroy all five guardians, obtain all five jewels, and defeat x himself. Easy enough, right? <laughs> Is that a joke? Is that a joke? Etro, easy enough. No, no, but seriously, I mean, I know I can probably do it. It's just gonna take a long time, because I have to level up, you know? I, I gotta beat some monsters, level up, get a lot stronger, and... yeah. Yes, I know it will take you a long time, but it's okay. As long as you're patient, and aren't reckless, and die a lot, you'll be okay. Okay, so this brings me to my next question, Etro. I don't know if you know this, but where exactly is the first guardian? Lucky for you, I do actually know where the first guardian is, but only the first guardian. During my time I was captured, they had a lot of information exchanging between themselves and I overheard a lot of conversations. The first guardian is in a place known as Gruntilda's Lair. It's a huge tower lair located east of the Besaid region. Besaid? Where's Besaid? Besaid is to the south of Bubble Gloop Swamp. Once you proceed south here from Viridian Forest, you will reach Bubble Gloop Swamp. After Bubble Gloop Swamp, keep progressing south and you'll reach the Bethay. In Bethay, you'll find some more NPCs that give you more important information as well as more important items as well. Once you're done in the Bethay region, proceed east from there and you will reach another important location. That location is also where Gruntilda's lair is located at. That is where the First Guardian is. But be careful, because he's a guardian, make sure that you're well prepared. Be a very high level, have good items, and also it would be nice to bring along other party members as well. Party members? Okay, okay, how do I get party members? I'm actually curious about this. You will find that out once you reach the save. But yes, there is a way to obtain additional party members in this game. 
Oh yeah, I'm excited, I'm excited. All right, all right, I think I got this. Good luck, I wish you all your journey. Thank you, Retro, so, so much, I appreciate it. Okay, let's go, Navi, are you ready? Time to head south to, what the hell is it called? Bubble f <laughs> All right, Bubblegloop Swamp, here we go. So, Etro said to keep going south from here, so I will follow what she says. I will keep going south from here. Let's go. Let's go, Navi. Oh man, encounter time. Looks like we got some swamp mushrooms, huh? Watch out. Yes, Navi. Status elements and poison. All right, I got it. So these guys can poison me. Got to be careful then. Oh man, these mushrooms are no joke. Guess I gotta grind a lot soon. Say, so, Navi, I have a question. So, Etro told me to go south from here, but what's to the west and the east from here? Listen. Wait a minute, so I can just go east right now and make it to the lair, to Gruntilda's lair right now? Why don't I just go there right now? Come on, let's go! Listen. Oh yeah, that's right. Alright, alright, um... Fine, I guess it makes more sense to go south first then, right? Alright, I got you. I'm an idiot, sorry about that. Man, another encounter? Are you kidding me? I just want to go to Besaid! Oh, what the hell is this? What the f*** is this? Some scary-ass looking flowers and... What the heck? Okay... Alright, Flower Elementals, you're going to die! Yeah, baby, another level up. Oh man, I am just on fire here. I am just on fire. Hey, look, an NPC. Hey, NPC, do you need some help here? Hello, I am the NPC Colin. I have a quest for you if you can help me, please. Can you please take this bag down to the safe to a person known as Delilah? Okay, so take the bag to Besaid to a person known as Delilah. I got you. Yeah, I'll do it. Thank you. Whatever you do, please do not open the bag by any means. Please do not. Um, okay. Yeah, sure. <laughs> like that guy thinks I'm gonna listen to him. Are you kidding me? Let's open it right now, Navi. Let's do it. What the fuck? What the hell is this? Are you... Are you shitting me right now? Listen. Well, yeah, I mean, I get that, Navi, but that doesn't change the fact that there's 30 fucking condoms in here. Like, what the hell? This is so strange. Whatever, I'm freaking done with this place. Freaking bubble gloop swamp. Let's just go down, Navi. Let's go down to Besaid, the Besaid region. Listen. What key items, you say? Alright, let's take a look at this. A map. An iPhone, a blue jewel locator, what the hell? Oh yeah, I got this from beating the freaking Black Knight. Let's let's take a look at it. 
Okay, so all the locator does is it shows the location of where that respective guardian is, right? But in this situation, it didn't really help that much because Etro already knew the location. But I guess in the future, it makes sense to try to beat the boss who has the locator first, right Navi? That way I can just uh, locate the location of where the guardian is, right? See, I'm getting this! I am so getting this, Navi! Oh yeah, this game is going down. But anyway, what is this iPhone for? Okay, for future people I meet. I see, I see. Alright, Navi, I see the beach! I see the beach right on the other side of this place! Let's go! Let's make a run for it! Hello, Besaide! Pretty beach, I must say. Pretty beach. Looks nice and peaceful, and, well, at least somewhat peaceful. But it's pretty. I like the view. Okay, so there's a lot of houses over here on the west side. I'm sure the NPC must be one of them. I'll just enter this one. Oh my god, are you... Okay, never mind. I'm just leaving and pretending I never saw that. Never. Let's try this one instead. Hello there. My name is Delilah. Oh, so you're Delilah. Okay, I have an item for you. Here's this bag. Oh, with the bag. That means you must be the chosen one, right? Uh, yes, I actually am. How did you know that? That quest you accepted is an interesting one, in which only you can accept. Oh, interesting, interesting. So, yeah, here's the bag for you. Take it. Thank you. My brother's actually the one who requested it. I'm not exactly sure why he wants it, but he did tell me that he was going to a sorority party today. But I still have no idea what's in here. Um, wow. Yeah, I mean, hell if I knew, right? Anyway, I have a very important and unique reward for you. Please take this orb. Oh, thank you very much. This is a special ally orb. There's very few orbs in the entire game. But basically, the orbs contain allies. These allies are able to aid you in battle, as an actual character. Oh, cool, so a new party member, huh? Yes, but keep in mind that the characters here don't actually possess a unique personality. Which means that they are not actual characters for you to talk to. They are simply an aid in battle. Oh, okay, I'm getting it now. But they're not like summons, right? No, they are not summons. Summons can only be obtained from the very powerful jewels. There are only five of them, as you already know. Orbs are still rare, but they work very differently. Okay, thank you. One more question. Why don't you talk like other NPCs, like the generic robotic sound effect? The reason why is because I'm not actually an NPC. Instead, I am what they call a guest character. I'm not just a one-time help, and I don't have to stay in this exact spot the entire time. I can actually go out and help you occasionally. Oh, I see. Really cool. Thank you, then. You're very welcome. Now, make sure to head east and go into Gruntilda's lair and defeat the monster guarding the jewel. Good luck. Yeah, I got it. Alright. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Delilah. I guess I'll see you in a bit. Goodbye. 